Hey guys, Luke and Frankie here. Uh, so we're at the Palos farm. We've just gotten all of our gear, all our safety equipment, our swags, our sleeping bags, our camping chairs, and our grills. Uh, we're about to hit the road. We pull into Moi, last grocery shop, head to Daga Hotel, where we have the best palmer in Victoria, before we head off into our tracks and uh, show you some really cool river crossings and some cool climbs. Stay tuned. So, our first stop, Dugger Hotel. It's a real central point to all of the cool camping spots, all the cool tracks. So we always start our trip here, get a good feed. Uh, they got the best palmers. Um, and then we look at the map and we plan from there. So we've just rolled into camp. Um, I love this camp spot because uh, you have to get through a few river crossings, uh, which makes this a little bit more exclusive. So one of my favorite camp spots, Talbotville camping area. Uh, so we've just pulled up. We're gonna crack the fire and get some dinner going. And uh, tonight we've got sausages. There's uh, a lot of hype around ice baths right now. Uh, it talks about like the benefits for your mental health, the benefits for your nervous system, makes you feel more energetic. And one of my favorite things about the high country, if you know anything about the rivers out here, uh, you have your own natural supply of an ice bath that's going on. So we like to challenge some of our kids who's prepared to have an ice bath in the morning. Um, so we're gonna start our morning with an ice bath, give us um, a really good positive uh, mental health, get our nervous system pumping, a lot of energy, and so we can tackle our day. Alright guys, so we've just packed up camp, um, so we're about to go back through the Crooked River, get about like seven to eight river crossings, and then we're going to go for a nice climb up Billy Goats to the top of the view where we're going to have a really nice lunch.
right now at one of my favorite spots in the high country. We're at the top of Billy Goats. Um, it's a really steep climb, few technical bits, uh, and then at the top you get an amazing view. Uh, so we normally like to come by here and have lunch, have a little picnic, um, and just enjoy the, the outstanding view of the high country. After this, it's just a quick little drive, about 15 minutes to our camp spot. We'll get the fire going, set up our swags, and get dinner going. So I've just pulled into camp at a horse yard flat. Swags are set up, the fire's going, so it's time to put dinner on. Beautiful morning here at Horse Yard Flat. Uh, we've just packed up our campsite. We're about to head to the nearest town for some breakfast before heading home to the Palos farm. Alright guys, so that's a wrap. Cars are unpacked, the kids are loaded, so it's time to get them home, and it's time to say goodbye for now.